my eyes, it's a little bit dark, but I'm going to be talking about how I got into the Stanford Stars Internship. Keep in mind that I did not participate in the internship, I actually interned at Chalk, but here's how I got into the Stanford Internship. The application process was pretty simple, I think there were a few questions, and this is how I answered them. To be honest, I didn't write too academically, I feel like I definitely wrote in a more interview-like way than I did academically. I think they just really wanted to see like, who you are, your experience, and that sounds very like boring, but I think that's really how it is because I didn't sound smart and sophisticated with big words, I just talked about myself and the stuff I have done. I think I was talking about like how I volunteered at the Discovery Cube and how it works with children but I did emphasize a lot on how I am a minority student being a woman in engineering. I talked a lot about how I dealt with misogyny and how I've never felt included in the STEM field because I was a woman. The people around me typically are, are guys and I tend to be friends with males because of this. I talked about how that made me feel and how I wanted to make the STEM field more welcoming towards women let's just get into the interview process i forgot to mention this but this is like ultra important i was very very shocked when i got an email from them saying that they wanted to schedule an interview with me they do pair you up with another intern applicant who has the same interview time as you there are four interns in the interview my partner is a student in an international school in hong kong and this was a little difficult because i live in psd i'd have to stay up to work on the presentation with him you're given a random case study. In my case study, it was on mobile social distance. It was basically like healthcare and how that affects people who are like always migrating. Here are the slides that we made. Less words on the presentation, but speak more. Emphasize it. Emphasize why it's important. The facts will always be on the screen in a concise way. I honestly didn't think that I would get in because during my interview, I was so nervous and I had a terrible day before. They assess you on your presentation skills, the way that you work with your partner. You have to answer the questions that those other two intern pairs ask you. And you also have to ask those two intern pair questions. For the presentation, you get five minutes to present and then I think two minutes to answer questions, I believe. It's interesting because last year, I applied by January 31st and I got a notice in March, but because this year is different and it's due November 3rd, I believe, um, maybe you had your results by like January, which is a lot sooner than what I heard. But yeah, I think because this is an awesome internship from what i heard i wasn't able to partake in this internship but i really hope that someone will take my advice or not hopefully my advice helps i wish luck to everybody